Super Soul. Thank you very much for tuning in. Look what I got. I got a bunch of boxes. <laughs> it's been a while since I've done a video like this. But yes, we have a major haul video today to show off, guys, and I'm really excited to show what we've got. So we've got two deliveries from Star Action Figures. Uh, we have a box from Fan Home, and we've also got a box from Comics and Cocktails. So let's start at the top and work our way through, shall we? Top box, like I say, this one is from Comics and the Cocktails. Let's see what's in the box. So again, none of these were on pre-order, guys. These are, these are all things I have picked up, not on pre-order. These are all just things I've purchased as they came into stock. So I've still been able to do it, guys. I'm quite impressed with myself. I've still not done any pre-ordering at all this year. And I've not missed out on anything yet. I'm still doing good. So, first up, we have Miggs Mayfield, the Morak version. Very excited to have that in the collection. Obviously, uh, Miggs Mayfield as well, very, very, very popular uh, character. He's very cool. Can't wait to review him. Also got my hands on the Clone Trooper, the two, the 212 Battalion. So very happy about that from Clone Wars. Could never have too many troopers. Never, ever, ever have too many troopers. So yeah, and those are from Comics and Cocktails. So thank you very much, Comics and Cocktails, for the hookup with these. These are absolutely awesome. But yeah, lovely. Can't wait, can't, can't, can't wait to get stuck in with the reviews. Love me a good black series, man. Love me a good black series. I made a mistake. One of those boxes wasn't even for me. <laughs> I started filming the, ne the next section. I opened it, and it wasn't even something for the channel. It was just something for the house. So, meh, I'm down to two boxes. <laughs> Uh, the, ne the next one is Fun Home. I, the, I thought the other one was was the other thing that I've ordered, but the other thing that I've ordered hasn't even shipped yet. I double checked. I'm such a doofus. The other thing that I've, I've got, I've got something else on order, and it should be with us hopefully later this week, um, as uh, Star Action ship it out. But right now, I'm cur currently still waiting. So do apologise about that. But let's keep going. We've got Fun Home. Fun Home send me these free of charge. By the way, uh, these are. Things that um, I've been sent for the channel. And it's the um, Star Wars Encyclopedias by Fan Home. So you get one a week, basically. So you get four a month. And this month we've got Kylo Ren and other users from the dark side, which also features the fall and redemption of Ben Solo, Supreme Leader Snoke, the Knights of Ren, and the Sith Acolytes. This month's Starships and Vehicles is all about TIE Fighters, from fighter maneuvers to battle, ta to battle tactics, to the TIE Defender, the TIE Bomber, and the Outland TIE Fighter. The Rise of the Rebellion and the Battle of Yavin is the new book for history and events. And this covers the tragedy of Tatooine, rescue on Death Star, the legacy of Alderaan, an impossible offensive, and the victory against all odds. And the final book this month comes in the form of Characters and Creatures, it's Yoda and other use, users of the Force. And this includes Qui-Gon Jinn, Plo Koon, Ponkrell, and Quinlan Voss. Not a bad little section of books there, to be honest. I like those. The Force users and the uh, dark, dark Side users are definitely two good books that would be worth a read. Because uh, Especially the one that's got Quinlan Voss and... Uh, Plo Kloon and Pong Krell, because they're characters like Qui Gon as well. They're characters that are in Clone Wars. They're in the they're in the film stuff, but you'd like to know more about, really. So yeah, I think that's going to be a good read that one this month. Excited about that. So we just pop those back together, and I'll pop these to the side. Oh God, that went that went that went the one with the bang, didn't it? Next up, this box is from, um, this one is from Star Action Figures. <laughs> Let's get it right this time. Yeah, this one is from Star Action Figures. And this is, again, all stuff that I've purchased myself. These were not for pre-order. These were things that were just in stock at the shop, ready to go. So we have the Star Wars A New Hope Princess Leia Organa from Yavin 4. So that's a nice one to go with our Luke Skywalker that we got. Because obviously Luke with the medal and stuff, that, that's been awesome. A picture opportunity to have Leia stood with him, so that's going to be nice. Of course, Chewie doesn't get a medal. 
bad people. Wookiee lives matter. Then we've got the Umbra Operative Arc Trooper from Battlefront 2. We're very excited to have him finally in the collection. Again, you can never have too many troopers, can you? The Umbra Arc... The Umbra Operative Arc Trooper is part of the Infiltrator Reinforcement Unit for the, Gala for the Galactic Republic in all the action-packed multiplayer games across all three areas of Star Wars Battlefront 2. Looks awesome. I love the black on the yellow. Such a cool concept. So yeah, can't wait to bust him out. But wait, there's one more! Finally, what could possibly be my character of the year already, and... I've just been dying to get this figure in hand since it was announced, and I finally have her, guys. Star Wars, The Book of Boba Fett, Fennec Shand. Yeah, buddy. She looks so good as well. Look at that face sculpt. She just looks so cool. I'm so glad I have her in the series, man. <sighs> Look at all these new figures. So, one, two, three, four, five new figures to add to the... Uh, pile of goodness to be reviewed don't worry guys i will start pumping out the reviews this week um i've already planned that the, the next week or so won't have any vlogs or anything i'm just going to literally pump out the reviews for you and get these reviews on the channel because i'm excited to film them uh we do have some uh great reviews coming on the channel so please if you are new around here smash that subscribe button subscribing really supports us it really helps us out and helps us to keep making awesome videos there are other places you can follow me on the internet, not just here on YouTube. I make TikToks on a uh, probably up to two to three a day at this point. I'm really enjoying bump, bumping out the you know the TikToks. You find me on there at Super Sorrel. You can also follow me and all my pictures and day to day life on the Instagram at you know at Super Sorrel. I really do enjoy Insta. Um, I do post up a lot of figure photography and toy news. And as always, guys, if there's anything you guys want to see on the channel, let me know in the comments down below. I'm always open to suggestions when it comes to Star Wars, toys, products, whatever. Let me know if there's anything that I don't review at the moment you'd like to see me review. As you guys have mentioned, you have mentioned Lego before, and I am waiting for some more of the Lego sets to drop. We've only had that one Luke Skywalker uh, and that big uh, Boba Fett set of the new stuff so far. So I am waiting for some things to drop. Uh, so please uh, be aware of that. Um, I'm not really going to be getting much Funko products anymore. I'm really getting a bit bored of Funko, to be honest. Um, but yeah, I'm always open to discuss like lightsabers and props and things like that. Things that could look cool in my collection. So, Comment down below if there's anything that you want to see me review that I don't already. That would be really cool. And uh, yeah, other than that, guys, just thank you very much for watching. I really do appreciate you all. So guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, I'm your host, Super Sorrel, but I'll see you in the next video. And until then, may the force be with you. Bye!